we see wars happen and slavery and persecution, extreme sin, extreme darkness, this wrestling with God and man and God choosing certain individuals to interpret. And all of a sudden, in this moment of despair and in this deep darkness, we see God show up in different ways through different men and women and, and begins to speak through them. And, and, here's, and, here's, and here's what God says through different prophets. He says that, I know you're in darkness now and I know that I am away. And I know our relationship has been broken for years, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years. But one day, woo, mm, one day I will walk among you again. Woo. I know that you have found yourself away from me. And in the beginning, we were together and we were separated because of sin. And I know you're in a dark place now, but one day, one day I will walk among you again. And here's what one of those prophecies looked like. Put that scripture up on the screen. And Isaiah says, for unto us a child is born, unto us a son is born is given and the government will be upon his shoulder and his name will be called wonderful counselor mighty god everlasting father prince of peace of the increase of his government and peace there will be no end upon the throne of david and over his kingdom to order it and establish it with judgment and justice from that time forward, even forever, the zeal of the Lord of hosts will perform this. For unto us a child is born. For unto us a son is given. And thousands of years later, from the Garden of Eden to John the Baptist, a son is born. And it becomes the fulfillment of prophecy. It's where we celebrate Christmas, right? We sing the songs. Oh, come let us adore him. It says the wise men came from afar. Angels came from everywhere saying that the Lord has been born. The, the, the son of God is on the earth and in the New Testament, in the Gospels, we see Jesus, God, walking among his people again. And people struggle to believe that it's actually him. They struggle. They call him a heretic and this man's lying. He's not God. He's not the Messiah. And you know what he starts to do? Woo! This is important. This is powerful. Don't miss this. Be because they don't believe it's him, he starts to do miracles, signs, and wonders so that they will know that this is God among them. He feeds the 5,000. He turns water into wine. He heals the sick. He heals the blind. All of a sudden, we see this human who is also God at the same time defying the natural. We see the super show up. <laughs> 